two-time Formula One victor Fernando Alonso won the rain abbreviated 24 hours of Daytona, upgrading Felipe Nasser two laps from the possible completion on Sunday. The Spaniard turned out to be just the third Formula One victor to win the race, joining Phil Hill, 1964, and Mario Andretti, 1972. It's stunning, Alonso told NBCSN. Only an astonishing background with this group from the test and now the race, an ideal execution of the race. Altogether different conditions and we've just a stunning knowledge with this group, from the test and now the race, an ideal execution of the race just an astounding background with this group, from the test and now the race, an ideal execution of the race he been focused in all things, dry, wet, night and day. Extremely glad for the group and all the folks. Alonzo who resigned from Formula One hustling after the 2018 season, said the triumph would rank high among every one of his achievements. To win this sort of perseverance hustling at famous spots like Daytona implies a great deal, he said. With zero involvement and foundation in continuance previously, a year ago, it's a significant huge thing. As of now the champ of a year ago's 24 hours of Le Mans, the 37-year-old Alonso will endeavor to finish the Triple Crown of Motorsports by catching the Indy 500 in May. Driving the Wayne Taylor Cadillac DPI, Alonso took direction of the race for the long haul when Brazilian Nasser neglected to explore Transform 1 and crashed into profound water, losing a 1.5-second favorable position. When Nasser had things leveled out, Alonso was 12 seconds ahead. Camry Kobayashi, Jordan Taylor and Ranger Van Der Zand collaborated with Alonso for the triumph in his second attempt in the 24-hour race which was twice red-hailed on account of rain and water on the track and was stopped 10 minutes early. With all the rain, I've never observed a race this way, Team Penske supervisor Roger Penske told NBCSN. Alexander Rossi was the main other driver to complete in the number one spot lap. He took third. Italian Alex Zanardi's arrival to Perseverance hustling 17 years after he lost the two legs in a horrendous race wreck got off to an awful begin a hour and a half into the race. Toward the start of his first spell driving, Zanardi experienced an issue with his directing wheel. The 52-year-old was utilizing a unique wheel with hand controls for the vehicle, and the interfacing pins were harmed when he endeavored to associate it as the vehicle was dropped from the jack. His number 24 BMW Team RLL group completed 32nd generally speaking and 9th in class. Revealing by Gene Cherry in Raleigh, North Carolina, altering by Claire Fallon.